Hey YouTube, this is Bronco Fan Eleven Two Thousand Three here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to download MP4 video files, like full-length videos, off the internet. There's no need to SSH or anything. You do have to have a jailbroken iPod though, or iPhone. But let's get started. Alright, the first thing you're going to need is D-Tunes. It kind of looks like that. If you don't need, know how to do it, then go to Cydia. You're going to need a couple things from Cydia in this one, so make sure uh, if you jailbreak it, you will have Cydia, so that's why you need to jailbreak it. Let it load and do its thing. Takes a lot of load. But it's important to let it load completely, all this crap at the top. Just make sure it's not loading anything else. Um, mine is done, so go to search. The first thing I would recommend downloading is Dtune. Just type in DTU, and there it is right there. Dtunes. You can't really see that, sorry. And. Once you're there, install it. Mine says modify, but you're going to need to install. Once that's done, go back to search. And this time type in S-A-F-A-R. It should be good. Go down to the S's. It is called Safari Download Plugin. It's right there. There's a little ball so Safari Download Plugin. Once again, it'll say install. I already have them both, so it doesn't say that. This basically enables you to download anything from a website and save it to a media player, and Dtunes is going to be that player. So after everything's done downloading, you should have a Dtunes icon. It'll be somewhere in the end, and you won't have a Safari plugin icon, of course, but yeah. Alright, so once you got that, open up Safari. And in your search bar, type in Ty's iPhone help dot com. I'll have a link to it in the box to the right. It's going to be a link to type this website in the box. But you need to do this on your iPod Touch or iPhone. Once you're here, at the very top, hold on. Come on, zoom in still loading all right at the very top you probably can't see it but you will see one called movies click it let it load yeah, sorry for the bad quality I know you guys can't see this but you get the gist of it. Once you're here, these are all the new release movies right here. You can, see, you can kinda see. Fast and the Furious 4, that's on there. But basically it's just a giant list of movies. There's a ridiculous amount. And they're all in alphabetical order except for the top ones because they're new releases. Notorious, Bolt, Gran Torino, Eagle Eye, Twilight, and then here's where it gets alphabetical order. Just click a movie, and after you click it, I'll just show you what it looks like. Uh, what movie do I want? Mm -mm -mm. I right, say you want new movie. Click the link. <laughs> it'll open up a new page. It, it'll it'll say some weird ad. Don't worry about that. Linkbucks.com. Don't worry about that. It'll bypass. It says in 15 seconds. That's the top in the green. You can't read it, but it says that. And then it should. Go, I think it goes to mega upload. Let's see, four, three, two, one, 
two, one. All right, now you should be directed. Mega upload, it took you. All right, now just worry about the top right. It's hard to do this one-handed. At the top right, you should get some letters. And they always make it, like, freaking retardedly impossible to see. I cannot read that shit. Q, Y, uh, F? Q, Y, F, 8, I'm gonna guess. So, let's enter Q, Y, F, Done. Download file. Alright, that was it. Now you're going to come to this page. There's a countdown timer right over on the right side. Let me adjust my camera a little bit. There you go, you can see the timer. 23 seconds. Alright, now once this is ready, it'll say, I don't remember what, it said something download. You're going to click that, and then it's going to come up with, uh, if you've ever used DTunes, the standard DTunes download or install. Download will be green, install is red, I believe. You're going to always want to click download first. I won't do it. Alright, it says regular download. Click it. I'm not going to do this because it might cancel it. It sh it'll open up a new link. Actually, it shouldn't. No, you don't want it to open up a new link. That is bad. New link equals bad. Don't let it do that. It should open up a new link. Just go back to the page you were just on. Now, there we go. Fast and Furious 4.mp4 download or play. If you just want to play it and you're going to be on Wi Fi for a while, just play it. Download, it will take um, probably about an hour to two hours, depending on your internet connection. It's a pretty big file. It's not big as most. It's just an MP4. You want you want to make sure, if you see, it will say fastfurious.mp4. Make sure it's MP4. Don't let it be a RAR or a... I don't know any other ones, but just make sure it's .mp4. And then once you're here, click download. Once it's fully downloaded, go back to home. Click DTunes. Alright, you're at DTunes. Click Browse. It's running slow. Come. Alright. Here's all my files. I have MP3s and IPAs. Just cycle to the right side if you have to cycle through some. IPAs are just the games that... Okay, just crash for no reason. That's awesome. They shouldn't do that. Good job, DTunes. IPAs are just the applications that you've downloaded if you use Installus. If you don't know how to do Installus, um, just post a comment or ask me a question or something. I'll make a video if a lot of people don't know how to do it. It's really simple. Just keep cycling until you see MP4 on the right side over here. Oh, there's MP4. I downloaded this earlier, Step Brothers. So. And your Step Brothers. The entire movie. Alright, and that is how you download full MP4 movies without SSHing into your iPod or paying for it. If you have any questions, just feel free to message me or anything. If you like my somewhat in-depth tutorials, just feel free to subscribe. If you have any questions or anything, post a comment or leave me a message. Thanks for watching.